Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lennon. Hi guys, doing a welcome to part three of our This Is Total War campaign with Rome in Rome 2. So let's get straight into it and let's see where we left things off last time. So last time we got countered, uh, counterattacked uh, with a little force of the Venetii with massive reinforcements of the Insubris. And I was debating to play this, but looking at my forces, I might be able to do some damage. I might be able to delete these guys, but I'm not sure if I can win those. But I think I'm still going to try to see how much damage we can do. Um, just to be of a nuisance. Because uh, if maybe if I kill this whole Fanatic army, they won't be able to take the city. So if this general dies, along with most of their troops, I don't know... If the city would then go towards the Insubris, or um, if they would still get the city, you know? Uh, the city is pretty easily defendable, th so that is good. Um, what have you guys? Squares over yes, here. Uh, you can guys can take the first charge. Uh, something like this. Italian Spears can go take the first beat. Uh, General... Um, they don't have any calf, so let's keep, keep them over here. And then we have our decent units, and then we have our shite units. Um, so let's keep these two over here. And let's keep these two over here. Let's see, for I don't know where the supers are coming from, so... Um, and I don't think I want to use javelins straight away, so I'm gonna toggle fire will off for now uh, and let's see where are they coming from Enemy reinforcements they're coming from over there okay so they will come in in this way as well good thing is um, let me get you over there let's see if we can Get that general a little bit of a head scratch. Good thing is they'll take. Well, I was gonna say they'll take some time, but units have been discovered. there are some fast boys. Our hidden units have been discovered. Um, because there's no way over here, so he would have to either go this way or have to go all the way around. Um, target that guy. See if we can rear charge the general. We await your command. It's just piling everything over there. Um, we would need to run down like everything to be able to get make sure they're dead. These were already already losing ground. Um, let's charge in here. That uh, does not do too much. Um, yeah, we have wiggle room over here. We have wiggle room, that's good. Stop firing. That general just needs to die. Okay, those guys are gone. Let's see what they're doing. General, get out. 
Um, where's the spear nobles? These guys need to die. That's basically it. Um, you guys pull back a bit. Come on, kill the enemy general. Why is it so hard to kill general? Okay, I have no idea how this is gonna go, but let's get these guys to go over this way already. And let's get our general over this way. Guys, able to fire. You should be able to fire. Like javelins are very effective in that part because they're just there's just nowhere to hide. Like, this is just one kill pit of javelins right now. There's not, <laughs> there's not one javelin that is going to miss. Uh, you get in here as well. You guys get over there. And I want to see if I can get my general all the way around here to see if I can start getting out those slingers. Without being absolutely targeted to death. Um... Uh, Okay, we round up one unit. Um, uh, if I put you like over this way, you should be you should you're able to fire. You're able to fire. Jupiter gives us strength! Although, guys, need to toggle, toggle guard mode. General, riders, advance. Quickly now. Um. Missile infantry at your command. Oh wow, there actually a lot is a lot of yellow red here. Okay, that's shit, because that we're buckling over there. You guys need to be there ASAP. Um, you guys get over there. Can we target the general, please? Levies. Our general has fallen. Oh. Well, fuck. <laughs> okay, yeah, that wasn't gonna help. No. Okay, that that kind of sucks. <laughs> Ooh, well, shit. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful. Okay, so that made this a definitely no-win situation. Uh, go over there. And we killed quite a bit, but like... Ooh, if those mercenary Celtic warriors are dying... That, that is... One of our units has used all its ammunition. A very needle, needed possibility. 
target those guys. Yeah, the short sword spam was a little bit excessive here. I can easily say we, we tried our best. Well, except with the general, we didn't try our best, but okay. This is a shameful display. These guys are. Our men flee the We're still afflicting some heavy casualties. That's. It's something. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a um. They lost more than we did, actually. Javelins are pretty okay. Those guys did sh nothing. Why? How? Are seriously gonna tell me the Finetii are taking this? How is that? Okay, we're still protected, so that's not too bad. Um. <laughs> we hunger for battle. Um, okay, so Can't what we are going to do... This is 9, the last 3 has... 8. We hunger for battle. Do we take that fight? Uh, that's a fleet. Okay, yeah, we take this. Waiting for a new course. Yes. Um. Okay, that is you done for today. And I was gonna get here another fleet. And get some ballista ships. We need good, um, you are not being a problem. The problem is this. Uh, can we win this? There's a lot of slingers in there. So let's hire that other calf unit as well. Um, so do we recruit over here? Or do we see if we can defend with this 18 stack over here and start building a new army in Rome? Which I think might be the better option. Um, and are we are starting to build Principes here, right? Auxiliary if true. Sokia, I study. Okay, no, you need to have that. That diminishes my uh, ability to build units this turn. Um, and since Are you ready to serve Rome? <laughs> okay, that that does help a lot. Uh, let's do that. And we are okay over here. Uh, diplomacy. We are at war with a lot of factions. Um, we really need to start wiping out some minor factions here. Like Ligeria, these guys have one settlement. Like, all of these factions have just one settlement, which is very annoying to deal with. Um, okay, I think that's it for this turn. Um, Arminium has only eight, which is really trashed. So even if I put this in here, I don't think, uh, yeah, he cannot get there. You can get there. Um, my spy needs to go back over here. Start stealing food. Um, which is this one. So they have minus five food. Maybe they start taking some extra attrition. And then we'll probably have a pretty big fight over here. So let's see if. Could have walked out of the city in an ambush, but in a field battle I would have not been able to defeat them. 
Let's see if they want to take the bait. That's a lot of slingers. Holy crap. Um, I do think we have a pretty decent chance of winning this. Because my army has 3 Hastati, sh should equal out their so short swords. I have 3 calf units, which if they sacrifice their light horse quite early on, what they usually do, I should be, should be able to run down most of these slingers. So I think this these two calf units were the best um, decision mercenary decision that was available to us right now. Mm. Yeah, these mercenary Celtics are annoying, but this settlement is is weird, you know, because like I can I can set my spears over here um, alongside like either one unit of levies and a unit of Hastati, which this is shot. And probably their calf is going to go over here, and a lot of them are going all the way around over here. Which means I need to defend this choke point over here. Um, so let's do that with these units. And let's get these prink pace over here. So they can either go this way or can help over here. Um, I'll have an extra unit of our study over here, and then these guys over here. Uh, what do we have left? Calf. I'll have them over here. So I think this is the, probably the fastest way um, out of the city. And then we have... I'll probably move them over here, but like if they get over here, they can fire up and over, so we need to be a little bit careful about that. Uh, let's get the plebs here, just for shits and giggles. So let's see which way they want to go. Calf is going straight in. Very good. What are you actually? Mercenary Italian Calf, okay. They're gonna fucking die. And they're gonna go... No, they're gonna help here. Question is, who's gonna go around? So if most of those slingers are going around as well, we might need to catch them on the flip side. Uh, okay, those slingers are staying over here. So as long as those short swords uh, just pass along this way. Okay. Let's get just the Italian calf. Let's keep my general in reserve for a bit. <clears throat> oh, those are some nice javelins. And those are slingers done over there. Uh, let's get my general out oh, this way as well. Um, to distract these short swords. And these guys are gone. Nice, okay. Target those. Keep them on their toes. Spearman! 
Tom and Spearman are getting battered by the slingers. Oh. Let's see them coming through. Uh, Calf, get out, get out, get out, get out. And probably you can go there as well. Okay, we need some a little bit of reinforcement. General, get out again. Uh, you target those guys. Let's take out those guys. And either with this army, we do need to push straight against Ligeria. It's like this is their, uh, probably their only army. This way. Serve up some javelins over there. Uh, you take out that one. These are some fun micro battles. Oh, uh, you are over that way. Uh, get in here. One of our units has used all its ammunition. And get over there. General, pull around. Do one rear charge over there. You take that one out. Short swords. How are we doing over here? They're getting absolutely annihilated. That is very good. Nice. These guys are gone. Uh, you take out those guys. This is going fabulous. <coughs> Let's go that way. Um, take out those guys. Uh, take out those guys first. Just need to have the short swords. Get in here again. Okay, perfect. Hey guys, firing on these guys. Javelins. Another round, another round, come on. Uh, oh, no, you can get in here, and you can go in the back, you can get them from the back as well. Uh, uh, we're gonna get the rear charge. That should do the trick, probably. Um, even the Rari held. Like, that, that is the fun part of playing as Rome. You know your troops will hold for, like, nearly an eternity. And only now is it turning in a favor, really? Uh, where's the general? If he dies, it would be great. But that's it. Let's see if we can kill the general. Perfect. Okay. Another heroic on the map. 336, 313, very nice. 215, 130.
We lost 440, they lost 2,000. Holy shit. Like, this is the big part. They didn't get to utilize any of their slingers. Like, if, you, if I had let these slingers just run around and just shoot, he could probably shoot my army to pieces. Um, let's get that, let's get some wealth going. Oh, they're coming for me as well, okay. Um, well, that's the army of short swords, right? Yeah, that's really sucks. Um, I could get into. How long? What does? Uh, fifty percent. And. If he attacks Arminium, I am not going to win that. So, probably what I'll do is I'll go over here. So, with this two forces, I can probably defeat that if he attacks this one. Um, why would I do this? There a tiny bit cheaper they are worse in every way probably the auxiliary infantry is better than the Rory but I'd rather go for the study I think that's a little bit of too yeah that's a little bit too risky. Retreat. If they want to attack me that's fine. <coughs> can I get another I can get another blister ship. Ready for orders. Ooh, Cosentia. That is a tough army. Let's see what they. Uh, let's see if that is a possibility. Um, see, these guys are starving, so that <coughs> that's not an issue. So we first just need to push back against the armies that were here. Uh, so let's see how we want to do that. We hunger for battle. Military traditions, weapon damage, and uh, tactician. Let's see, let's see, what is this going to take? Yeah, that is unavoidable. There is barely enough money in your treasury to cover costs. You can ensure your provinces are taxed effectively um, by ensuring their settlements are upgraded to the highest available. Where the hell are you going? Ready for orders. Um okay, that was an army. Ready for orders. Really? Okay, we're gonna fight this just because I wanna I wanna show how overpowered these ships are. Probably gonna fight a lot of sea battles because there is no way that is that we are losing this. Artillery ships ready. 
Um, let's take that one. Come to us, okay. Now, prepare your weapons. Um, let's go standard rounds. Yeah, let's go standard rounds because flammables are less accurate. Did these guys, did these guys get nerfed? Guys are gone. Oh, so close. Okay, it was not the idea that my general would die, but eh, okay, not <laughs> not all too great. Um. We need to have some strategies in place. Um, wait, where do we go? You go over this way. I think we delete these guys. That should save us a little bit of cash. And then we deal with those guys and we deal with Medlin. Rome is probably able to hold, uh, hold on on its own. Um, so we go through the end turn and that's gonna be the end of this episode. So let's see what this last turn brings us. If we have a little bit of a cl cliff edge, cliffhanger for the next episode. Your faction is now bankrupt. There is no money left in your treasury, but there are several things you can do to reverse the situation. Raise taxes if possible. Establish further trade agreements and um, trade routes, or disband unused units. Can you use these guys to raid? That should take us, get us a little bit of cash. And I don't like the real, don't really like the odds, but we probably have to fight this. But that is, it's not fun. 
Um, probably should have gone into an ambush. At least at this point we can grab some cash. Um, the RDA. Over there. We have not seen any new units. Okay. Oh, you guys are taking up a lot of cash. Something like that. That is probably... Oh, that's our spy, okay. Um, steal more food. See, these guys are... Ain't worth shit. So that's good, so we keep them, we keep them under, we keep them weak. I think I need to do that to the Madelanians as well, but I don't think I can do that. Um, as, lo as much as I would love a peace treaty, it's not the idea. Okay, and that is where we leave this episode off. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, and do subscribe to the channel uh, as it's been greatly appreciated. And by all means, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.